Hey guys, today we're gonna to take a look at this nice little gimbal that was sent out to me for review. This is the Oshwan Smart XE. Now this gimbal comes with a lot of new features, including a magnetically connectable uh, light, uh, selfie light that comes with it. So let's take a look at everything that comes in the box. This is a three axis smartphone gimbal with a ton of features. Let's go. All right guys, so in the box, the first thing that we're gonna be greeted with is our uh, gimbal itself. Now there is a little flyer here that has some information about the light itself. We'll talk about that here in just a little bit. Let's put that off to the side. Let me go ahead and pull the light out so you guys can take a look at it. So this is the light that we're referring to and as you guys can see this light has two magnetic points where you can connect this light directly to the gimbal. That's really nice. Alright so we also receive we also receive this little uh, mini tripod that can be also used as an additional hand grip. So this is really nice, feels good, nice rubber uh, inserts here. It feels, you know, pretty, pretty nice in the hand. Guys, I'm gonna be honest with you, it does feel very, very robust. Okay, so here is our actual gimbal. We're gonna come back to this in a second. This is the folding type, really nice design there. So we're gonna take a look at, you know, how to utilize this, all of the different features, the button controls. Here's your magnetic plate that you're gonna connect that light to. So we're gonna come back to that, as well as it comes with the starter manual, and this is gonna help you get started as far as, you know, setting everything up. Here are your QR codes to um, install the app. So that's for Android or for iOS. I'm gonna be using this with an Android phone today, but I also have an iPhone 14 Pro Max, so I'm pretty sure they're right about the same size. This, if it can accommodate the Android phone, it should have no problem accommodating uh, this, um, my iPhone. So you get this USB-C to USB-A cable. Other than that, uh, there's nothing else in the box. The foam does not come out. All right, so here is our gimbal. First thing we want to do is we want to connect this uh, handle to it like so, and this just screws in, no problem. Really nice little snug fit. You don't have to over tighten it. And then you'll be able to just sit this down flat on your desk, pretty much like so. Now, when this opens up, guys, it's going to open up kind of in a, like a, a seven shape, the number seven. So when you pop this open, you're gonna get something that looks a lot like this. And what you want to focus on is when you're connecting your phone to it, make sure that this um, text is facing upward because that is actually the top of the cradle for connecting your, um, your light. And as you see, you have your two connection points here for the lights. You can mount the light underneath or on top. This is a Note, um, Note 10 Plus, if I'm not mistaken. So it's a pretty large phone. So we're gonna go ahead and pop this phone in. So to balance your phone, you're basically gonna keep sliding it until you get it to a point where it does balance. Uh, just kind of sliding back and forth. Let me adjust the camera so you guys can see that a little bit better. Now you may not get this perfect, uh, but you know you wanna get pretty close to trying to balance the phone as much as possible so that you have that, that equal balance, something along the lines of that. That's what you're kind of looking for. And as you see, the phone does kind of, you know, uh, go past the motors because of the angle and the design, that should be fine, no problems there. Okay guys, so here is the QR code that we're gonna scan. So I'm just gonna bring my phone right here, as you guys can see, it's gonna scan that QR code and then it's gonna give me the option to go over and install that from my app store. And you're gonna choose your app store. So I'm gonna to go to the Google Play Store and hit install. And really quick, it's really simple. You're just gonna enable this, or you're gonna download it. In my case, it's enable because I already had it installed. So I can just open this app, and then I'll be able to connect to this gimbal once, um, once I have everything set up. And you can kind of slide through the app. You're gonna see all their different gimbal models that they have here. Now, once you turn this on, it will identify your, your specific gimbal. So as you slide through, as you guys can see, there's a number of different gimbals on here, but the one that you wanna focus on is the one that you actually have. All right, guys, so now I'm gonna power this gimbal on. I'm just gonna press and hold the power button and wait for it to turn on. So as you guys see, the gimbal did just turn on. So now all I have to do is hit direct connect. And this is now connected to uh, this phone. All right. It's literally that simple, guys. Just connect it. And then once you're in the app, you're going to find all of these other features. You're going to find your 
um, your uh, kind of like a time lapse feature here. You have your standard time lapse, you have your video, photo, panoramic, you have this Hitchcock, you have this Inception, you have some moves. So if you go to this mode right here, this is gonna allow you to see other features that you can do with this uh, with this uh, with this gimbal, which is really nice, as they provide you with that information to help you get started. You know, a lot of um, product companies don't provide this type of insight when it comes to working with their devices. So I find that very interesting. All right, so let's take a look at some of these buttons real quick. So you have a joystick here, which allows you to move the gimbal back and forth up and down. You also have different modes. So if you tap on this button here, it's gonna switch you between the modes. So I went from follow to POV. You can tap again and go back and forth between those modes as you guys see here. And if you want to select something, so let me show you what's happening with the joystick. So as I move the joystick left and right, up and down, I have total control over what the camera does you know, using this gimbal. You also have a focus ring and you have a telephoto right here for zooming in and zooming out. All right, so uh, the light that comes with it, let me grab the light. So here's the light that comes with it. Like I said before, it connects magnetically. You have two options. So you have the option of mounting the light underneath. So you can mount the light underneath the gimbal or you can underneath the uh, cradle or you can mount the light on top of the cradle just like this. And then you can reverse this if you want it facing in the opposite direction, maybe you know something that's behind that you're gonna be looking at. And it has a number of different RGB settings. So let me show you. I'm just gonna power this light on real quick. So we're just gonna power it on. And you guys can see kind of the color modes. I have it kind of like in a, a mode where it's just kind of going through the different colors. You can switch between the different modes by just pressing on this mode button and it's gonna allow you to switch different colors to go all the way back to your just your standard set it, uh, setup light. So you have a ton of different features uh, with this light. You know, you have some strobing effects. A lot of features that you normally see in very high-end uh, practical lights are all included with this little light that you can easily attach to this little gimbal. All right, guys, I just wanna do a quick video showing you guys this gimbal and some of the things that come along with it. A uh, quick way to install the app um, so yeah, I think this is a really nice little gimbal that's going to be ideal for you guys going out, kind of running and gunning, you know, creating content. You know, it's very compact. It's going to be very easy, you know, to set up and to take apart. So when you're done with this, you're just going to fold this up, take your phone out, fold this up, take off the uh, little tripod and you're going to be pretty much good to go. All right, guys, it's been Rome with Rome Knows Tech and I will catch you all in the next video. Until then, stay safe. Peace. I am out.